But Brad Pitt is producing a World War Z series series <laughs> for Apple TV Plus. So Did the movie even do good? It did, oh, it, it did no. all right. I mean, so I just, it was a hundred ninety million dollar budget, and it made five hundred and forty million dollars. <laughs> so not just bad. Have one thing to say: I saw that they're doing this, and I was like, "Oh, cool! They actually do it like the books." And then I saw that it no, it's a, just a continuation from the movie, and I was like, "I'm Ew, good." So no. we can move on yeah. to the next topic now. That's yeah. it. That's what's happening. Yeah, yeah I agree with Jake. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I like Brad, total I like Brad shit. Pitt in this. So I like Brad Pitt. But total overall, shit. Like, they didn't do it. If, they were supposed if to do they, it. They were actually, if they could have at least followed the books, I like then it would have been cool. But like the fact yeah. that they're okay, like if they're like, okay, we're gonna give you a TV series, I'm like, okay, we're gonna try this again. Then you're gonna follow the books, right? Oh, you're not gonna follow the books, so we're not gonna get the fucking like anything from the books. We're gonna get that like awesome battle on the Indian road, or we're not gonna get the underwater like welder stories, or we're not gonna oh fuck it. Like, I'm so done. I'm so fucking the battle of Yonkers. We're not we're never gonna get the battle of Yonkers. Uh. Like, what the fuck? Like, I would love at least one of the fucking battle of yonkers like that would be like the bare minimum i'm like you guys are such failures and it's like everything that they did with this like it could have been a big giant international story that could have brought like all these like different like you know races and religions and that? all this stuff well, i mean we gotta give them a chance though they fucking, we, gotta, you know, we gotta give them a chance yeah, it's, let me it's break a this little down early so out there it's, so everybody kind of knows what's happening but so the 2013 action movie of course with, with brad pitt is coming back <laughs> I know action or horror <laughs> movies, more action, action movie, action blockbuster. <laughs> but Brad Pitt's producing this for Apple TV Plus. And, you know, of course, like Lexi said, it's based off the 2006 Max Brooks novel, World War Z, an oral history of the zombie war. And, Fantastic you know, at the very book. end, they had that vaccine. If they don't need the vaccine, they can't see you. And so they're saying right now it's probably be a continuation, but they're, they're being very vague about this as well. Because whether it has Brad Pitt starring in it again, they haven't said exactly he is producing, but I would think that he would probably be continuing especially like apple tv is always doing this they're like bringing big names in and they're making huge shows off this so i would think that's what they'd be doing but i'm not really sure yet but world war z as a series maybe they should have done a series from the get-go but back when they made yes. it it was only a tv it was only movies you know that's what it was it was a movie world sean what do you think do you think that this will work as a series or would you want them to do a sequel because fincher almost did a sequel apparently but then they canceled it so it almost happened for good reason. Yeah, I, I don't want a sequel to the, to the movie. Um, I, I'm totally with my with my other panelists here that the book was just, you know, what you really wanted, I would say, in an adaptation that that book, you know, could be amazing as a TV series, especially if they're just taking the chapters, you're following the characters and it's sequential. So the timeline kind of makes sense. Like there's just so many nice tidbits in that book. And, you know, aside from the title, I, I'm, I'm having trouble remembering what else it really ties it to the book itself. Um, uh, I guess, you know, the fact that they showed different cultures. Zombies? And, okay, yes. <laughs> zombies, yes. I, yes I, I forgot about the zombies in World War Z. Yeah, my, my apologies. There are um, viruses and zombies. Yeah. No, it's, about, it's about it. I, I, I would uh, love to see mounds. an adaptation. Yeah. There, are, yeah. there are people Human getting bit healed. by it. Yeah, there are. Yeah. Yeah. But you it, think it, you it, think it, that Brad Pitt's going to star in this, though, Sean? Or do you think that he's just going to produce it and, you know, be like in that role? I, I don't I don't see what what other life his character could have. Uh, it, it has been several years that I you yeah. know forced myself and punished myself to to watch this movie. Um, but from what I can remember, I think things kind of wrap themselves up for him and his storyline. I don't really know where else you would want to go with that. Um, I'm all for it. I love zombie content. I just finished um, uh, uh, the George Romero book, uh, The Living Dead, which was fantastic. Highly recommended that uh, if you watched or if you read World War Z, I should say. Um, but yeah, I, I'm a big zombie, zombie guy. So if they do it just as fine, if it's a continuation of the world that they already built in the movie, it's probably going to be a pass for me. Well, hold on. D did you say Fincher was supposed to do the sequel? Fincher was supposed to do the sequel. Yeah. Now, apparently then now, they canceled it. I'll be honest. Which makes sense for the two of them with, with Brad Pitt. Uh, uh, if if not, Fincher's, if no, Fincher's don't, doing don't it, get I will. excited. No, no. Excited. the sequel was going to be uh, how to survive the zombie apocalypse. That, that's okay. Really like War War Z is just it's written by the Fincher. same author. It's Fincher. It I, like, I mean, Fincher is, is it a top been, director. They would have called it World War Z, too, but it would have been. I don't really care. Anything he touches is cold. 
he's fantastic. He's he's a tough guy to work for, but he does Never do a great job. He's studying every care. frame, every <laughs> shot. He wants to make sure it's perfect. Like I said before, I've worked on Mank. Ah, when I worked on Mank, it was like, I remember like, I, I was hear... just setting a shot up and I was like working with the DP about putting a fly swatter down. And I know he's fucking watching that shit. Really, he's like, okay, go down, up, down. I hear, down, 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 slap. And I'm like, oh shit. And I slapped it. Thank you. Thank you. And I was like, oh, that's fucking intense, you know? But that's Fincher, and he's just like he's always looking at every aspect. Then you'll then you'll meet him off set, and he'll be like, "Hey man, how you doing? So happy to see you today. You're doing a great job." And you're like, "You just screamed at me, but you know it's cool." <laughs> you know, that's amazing. But he's just intense. But his stuff is so specific. He has the whole thing edited in his brain. Right? I think it could have been good, but this is oh a my whole God. different thing. The cinematography would have been fucking spectacular. It would have been, been great. It would have been great. You know, spectacular. <laughs> <laughs> and, and he would have got awesome. Atticus Ross and like Trent Reznor to the soundtrack. It would have taken a year and a half to shoot. <laughs> it would have taken a long time. It would have oh, yeah. taken five an years. Movie five years to shoot. Like <laughs> 174 <laughs> takes of that stunt sequence. Like, are you kidding? It would be very, very difficult. I mean, yeah, he would he would shoot for a long time. I mean, he would rehearse for you know a little bit of time, and he would shoot for like we do a setup for like 45 minutes on that make, and then they shoot it for like four hours, one setup. So it was like it was like what's happening? But I'd be like, I guess I'm gonna go. Take a shit and walk you know it what? off and come back. So I got here's plenty a, of time. David Fincher can scream at me all fucking day. It would have been a better movie, and even as a movie by Fincher, I'm sorry, it Brian. Have had less, it would have had less zombies now. in it, and it still would have been better. <laughs>